Tonight, we're counting down to a historic space launch. Behind us, a live look at the Kennedy Space Center. The Artemis One rocket set to lift off into space just hours from now. The world is watching as NASA prepares for this critical step to once again send astronauts to the moon. NBC Bay Area's Christy Smith spoke with an astronomer at the Chabot Space and Science Center about what to expect ahead of the big launch. So this first mission, Artemis 1, is kind of a, a road test of all of the systems. Gerald McKeegan is an astronomer with the Chabot Space and Science Center in Oakland. The idea of this mission is to, to launch the Orion, send it out to the moon, put it in orbit around the moon, and eventually uh, return to Earth and test out all of the systems that will be involved uh, when we eventually send humans back to the moon, most likely in 2025. He says NASA had been anxious to get back to the moon and eventually onto Mars for some time and over the last 10 years put a focus on that. The Space Launch System, which is the, uh, the largest launch vehicle that uh, NASA has built, uh, on top of it is the Orion capsule, which hopefully will eventually carry uh, astronauts to the moon. But for this mission, the Orion capsule is not crewed, uh, so it's just an empty capsule. Meantime, NASA officials held another briefing today as anticipation builds for tomorrow morning's launch at the Kennedy Space Center in Cape Canaveral, Florida. Officials confirmed that despite lightning strikes to the towers at the launch pad, the mission is on track for the inaugural launch. Our team right now is, uh, I will say, super excited, and we are um, prepared for, for anything I think that throws at us to the four WDRs we've done in the past really, I think, have prepared us uh, for the moment we're at now for, for virtually any situation that can come up. Um, but we are excited. The vehicle's going to be ready. And they have a two-hour launch window. And we're all, we've all got our fingers crossed that it's going to be a successful flight. Christy Smith, NBC Bay Area News. Artemis set to lift off around 5.30 tomorrow morning. We'll have complete coverage of the launch on Today in the Bay, beginning at 4.30.